Hello and welcome to Yara's YouTube channel. My name is Allison Hebert and I'm a sales agronomist with Yara. Uh, if this is your first time tuning in, thank you for joining. But if you've been with us for a while, you know we've been talking about our Yara Vita Pro Coat product line. It is a patented oil-based micronutrient coating that gets applied directly onto your granular fertilizer. Today, I want to do a bit of a deeper dive into our Yara Vita Pro Coat Zinc uh, product and really talk about zinc's physiological role in the plant. Uh, now, why are we focusing on zinc? And especially in Western Canada, I really want to talk about why we decided to focus on zinc. And really, it was because when we started looking at soil samples and averaging or figuring out the average uh, soil sample that comes back deficient in zinc, we found that 25% soil samples for Alberta were coming back uh, deficient in zinc or below that critical value. And what I mean by that critical value is a number where if that nutrient comes back below that, uh, that crop is most likely going to have um, a response when that nutrient is applied. It's not in a high enough solution in the soil to, to really reach the yield goal of, those, uh, of that crop. 42% uh, of the soil samples in Saskatchewan are below that critical value and 27% in Manitoba for zinc. When we're looking at the plant, we know that nutrients, all nutrients are required for this plant to perform at its best, but it's all, they're also required at different stages. The demand changes as that plant goes through different uh, environmental conditions or stresses. Uh, zinc, really important at root development. It's a key player in growth hormone production. Without a good level of growth hormones in this plant, it's not going to go through its stages properly. Uh, with uh, when we get when we're in the vegetative stage, uh, we're really looking at high levels of photosynthesis going on, and zinc is um, important in the production of chlorophyll. And without proper chlorophyll in that plant, we won't have enough green material for that uh, for it to go through photosynthesis efficiently. And um, the the deficiency symptoms, I guess, of zinc are uh, striping, chlor uh, chlorosis striping or intravenal striping, and the more yellow that's on that leaf uh, material, the less photosynthesizing that's actually going on. Uh, as the plant moves through the season, obviously, like I said, nutrients are required at all stages of this crop, uh, but zinc again at grain formation and quality. Uh, zinc is um, important in protein synthesis, we need to make sure we have good protein levels in our crops. I know our cereals, we're really paying attention to those levels. Maybe um, with canola meal, we want to make sure protein's up. And also zinc is important for nitrogen assimilation, especially in cereals. So Yara Vita Pro Coat, um, this product being an oil-based micronutrient coating uh, that gets applied onto your uh, granular fertilizer, whether that's your straight urea or it's your starter blend, your FOSS, your potash, maybe even your sulfur, it really can be put on all granular fertilizer. But once it's applied, those each granule that gets put down into the soil becomes a new feeding site for that um, for that plant of that nutrient. Uh, normally, if we were working with a gran granular micronutrient blend, we'd maybe only get a third of a granule per foot of row, where if we're doing a 100 pound um, fertilizer, granular fertilizer rate, we're getting about seven or eight granules per foot of row. And that just makes sure that every plant in that field has access to that nutrient. Zinc is not a mobile nutrient in the soil, so that's where if you get it on with your pro coat uh, nice and close to the seed, the roots don't have to go far in order to take up that nutrient. And as I said earlier, it's important at the root development stage, so nice and early is important. Um, like I, it's on every granule, making sure that everywhere it goes down, those roots have access. And it's just better distribution, meaning every plant has the ability to take that nutrient in and respond to give um, a higher yield potential. Uh, our values for Yara Vita Pro Coat, better nutrient access, like I was saying, with the increased feeding sites, improved fertilizer handling. It is an oil-based product, so it will reduce the dust on your pro uh, fertilizer and an increased ROI by allowing every plant in that field to have access to the nutrient and we are no longer limiting it. 
So thank you for joining me today to learn a little bit more about Yarvita Procoat Zinc. Uh, if you have any questions, please contact your local Yar rep. Our information is on yarcanada.ca and I would encourage you to check out a few of our other videos on other products and also uh, individual nutrient role in the plant. Thank you.